lovelies. It is quarter past one and I've only been up for about half an hour. Um, as you guys know I've had such a crappy few days. I'm so tired and so sore that I just cannot stay awake but I'm up. Um, I'm actually drinking a cup of a real energy coffee. Um, it's one of the ones from the FM group. So I'm hoping that sort of perks me up a bit because I really need to get some things done around the house today. I'm getting so frustrated. Um, last night after I signed off, I was wide awake until around 3 o'clock this morning. Um, I probably dozed off not long after that and... And then I was awake again around half five. Um, oh. Kind of shooting pain going from my shoulder right through to my fingers. Anyway, um, I only got a about two hours sleep during the night and then I sort of dozed on and off for the morning um, but I was having nightmares and like crazy dreams and stuff it was one of those ones where it just was not restful at all um, Not that I ever feel rested after sleeping. I don't know about you guys, but that's one of the things that gets so frustrating for me is that there's sometimes that you might sleep sort of properly and still be exhausted the next day. I mean, I've had times where I've been so sick that I've slept constantly for a couple of days and I'm still exhausted. I hate that. I hate it. Um, I hate that I can't get to sleep at a proper time at night. It is so frustrating. I hate being so tired. I hate not getting up until late into the afternoon. I don't like miss missing the morning. Oh. My eyes feel all gritty today. And my skin is all dried out. It's horrible. But anyway, I... I'm just gonna chill and watch some shows on Netflix. Um. I went to look and see if there was another series of Ringer. I used to love that show, but it was cancelled after one series. That sucks. But anyway, I have watched all of Drop Dead Diva. I'm not amused about that. So I will move on from Drop Dead Diva. Watch Bones. I love Bones. Oh, my eyes. Alright, I'm gonna go and drink my coffee and then I'm gonna rinse my eyes out and hopefully make them feel better. And I will chat to you all in a bit. Okay, so I'm just making some toast for Thomas. Um, I've been watching some bones and as I say I'm just about to make some toast for Thomas and then I'm going to go upstairs and chill with him and chill with him a bit and um, tempted to make myself some toast and a bit peckish but apart from that nothing really exciting is going to be happening today I'm probably going to pop around to the in-laws later um, and we order arrived for them. It is 
I ordered these online. Um, they're lavender wheat filled wraps that are really good for people with arthritis and pain and things like that. So I ordered two, one for each of them. I'm also going to order a couple for myself as well. Um, but I ordered theirs first. I don't know whether I've ever mentioned it or not, but my mother-in-law has a lot, a lot of pain. And unfortunately, even though she is 78, she has never been diagnosed with arthritis and has really struggled to get medication to help her. So I always try and do what I can to sort of help. And she generally uses hot water balls, but I don't find um, them comfortable for your neck and shoulders because they don't they don't wrap around. It's almost more of a burn sometimes, for me anyway. So I thought I would ask her to try this. Um, if it doesn't work, I mean, I'll use them myself because they don't save me buying anymore. Um, but I do think they're very, very good for that kind of thing. Um, and you don't need to worry about burning yourself or anything like that with hot water. Um, so we will see. Hopefully they will be good for them. Um, so apart from that, I will talk to you all later. So me and Thomas is still taking it up to him. We're just waiting on my night and then I'm going to go and edit yesterday's vlog and get it uploaded. Much for getting everything uploaded the night before. It didn't last long. Hopefully whenever I'm starting to feel better and not so tired at night that I'll get it done. Um, I do need to start remembering to stop vlogging at 9 or before it because if I don't then it takes forever during the night for everything to work, me included. <laughs> but anyway, it's nearly Friday guys, what have you all got planned for the weekend? Anything nice? I'm going out tomorrow night to a friend's house for a couple of hours, she's having a um, pamper chef party, little chef party. She's having a party at her house anyway where people come along and somebody cooks food and um, it's to sell kitchenware. I really need to look into that because I'm not entirely sure but I haven't seen her for a couple of months now and I miss her like crazy so I can't wait to get over and see her. Lynn and I are going um, so that'll be fun. So I'm looking forward to that. Obviously not be vlogging while I'm there because that would be inappropriate at someone else's house but I might vlog on the way or the way back, who knows? But anyway, hopefully toast will pop up soon. There you go, right on cue. So I'm away to eat my toast and drink my tea. Chat to you later. Alright my darlings, well I'm getting ready to go around to the in-laws. So As it is extremely cold outside, I am going to put my hat on. This will be the first, oh, first night. This year I'll have worn a hat. What, sorry, this season. I probably wore a hat earlier in the year, whenever it was wintery. So, I have to say, since I used that used stuff in my hair last night, I don't have the same sort of tots or anything like that, I have to say. I really quite like how it feels. So that's good. Okay, so. Although, I have to admit, it doesn't feel like first day hair. So, my beanie. My bubble. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Oh, bubble, bubble. So, I don't wear my hats like this here. I don't really sit them like that. That just doesn't look right on me. It doesn't look right. I just look silly, I think. So, So I don't turn it over, I just do this. I wear it like this. Does it look good? Is it nice? Should I go out like this? No. No. So this is how it looks. Oh, 
wintery. I absolutely love whenever the weather is so cold that I can wear hats and things. My problem is the rest of the year I'm so warm I could run about in October wearing a vest top and feel fine. But once it gets to this sort of weather where it's cold enough for me to wear a hat, I love it because I don't feel so sick and sweat like, I don't know what, a pig in a butcher's. No. Is it cute? Sorry about the light in here. I'm right underneath the light on it. It's so yellow. I'm going to need to get my hair trimmed again. I don't want much of the length, I just think it needs a wee bit of a trim of the dead ends. So anyway, my lovelies, now that my pom-pom is on, I am going to grab my coat and scarf and I'm going to head round to the in so I will chat to you when I get back. Bye-bye. Hello my sweeties, it is 5 to 11 and I'm back from my in-laws, walk the dog, um, stay for a cup of tea, to stay much longer. I watched an episode of Bones and now I'm coming up to bed because I'm so tired and I'm going to the market in the morning I'm definitely going in the morning because my grandmother's going to be there and I haven't seen her in a couple of months so I really want to get in, give her a big snuggle and it'll be really nice to see her so I want to see if I can pick up a couple of Christmas presents as well so I want to get in for that so I'm going to sign off and I will see you all in the morning Good night, love you. Bye.